Hello, my name's Jennifer Holden and I'd like to invite you to the IATFL pre-conference event being held jointly by the Global Issues SIG and the Inclusive Practices and Special Educational Needs SIG. The event is being held before the main event on the 16th of May and the whole day will be dedicated to exploring English language student and English language teacher identities. So I'm Jenny and I'll be talking about uh, the issue of teaching practice students and uh, thinking about what opportunities lie here in terms of getting to know more about these students and opening up language instruction to a wider range of students. In, a, in my interactive talk, we'll be exploring the differing learner identities that we find in a teaching practice classroom. Often we find that uh, students uh, who come to be guinea pigs or teaching practice students within our classrooms often come from different backgrounds to a, a typical traditional language teaching classroom. This is often the case because these courses are free for learners and as such we can open it up to people whose financial means might not normally stretch to private language instruction. So. We'll be looking throughout the talk at how we can encourage both trainers and trainee teachers to identify these differing learner, learner needs in the classroom. We'll be thinking about the lived experiences and the pre-existing knowledge that these students bring into the classroom. And we'll be looking at practical techni techniques and practical tools that you can take away into your practice and hopefully help you identify differing learner identities and their motivation patterns. And we'll be opening up the discussion to think about how we can encourage a more inclusive um, and diverse range of students within our language in institutions as a whole. So whether you're an experienced trainer or an experienced teacher or more of a novice teacher, hopefully there'll be something that you can take away, not just food for thought, but practical tools and techniques. So I look forward to seeing you there.